Greetings everybody. What I'd like to talk to you about tonight is religious rights. If you are a non-mainstream believer, your religious rights could be in danger. The United States says that we have a freedom of religion, but that is also a freedom from religion. There are certain Christian groups that are trying to slowly chip away at the understandings in the Constitution. We have groups like wall builders who want to say that this nation is a Christian nation and you are free to be whatever form of Christian you want to be. And that's wrong. What we need to do is to work together. We need to get in contact with atheists and pagans and inform each other and support each other through petitions and such so that we can let the world know or mostly let the US know that we're not going to allow this to happen. Now it's very important um, this is targeted towards the pagan groups here. We have a problem with working together because like the Christians we compare our beliefs with other people. You know you have the Norse versus the Celtics and Hex and such. We can't afford this. We got to work together. We can't have infighting. The Christians have infighting, but they have millions of people to back them up so they can afford it. They also have a very well established machine that drives their points across. We don't. If you are an atheist or a pagan, I want you to get in contact with other atheists and pagans in your area and work out a network of communications. Help inform each other of what's going on. And in doing so, we can protect our rights. Just last year in Iowa, they tried to submit a bill that would give business owners the right to refuse services to people of a different religion. Do you know how scary this is? If somebody finds out that you're an atheist or a pagan, you can try to go buy groceries and the person can say, no, I don't have to serve to you, leave. We can't, hand, we can't have this happen. So like I saying, let's work together, let's inform each other, and so that we can protect our religious rights as American citizens. Thank you and good night.